Hey everyone, it's a little bit later in the day. I forgot to film an intro, but I thought I would bring you along with a shop with me. Uh, we are here in a insert place now in Noonan, Georgia. Did a quick stop through. Didn't end up finding too much for resale, but it was a lot of fun anyways. All right, everyone, we are here in Noonan, Georgia at a wonderful antique store. First I'm seeing are all of these vintage and antique bottles. Oh my gosh, snake oil. Did you see the sign in the back? And look at this daisy little shaving cream pack. Oh my gosh, so sweet. Uh, trying to do a slow kind of panorama view. Uh, unfortunately, the light is pretty blinding coming in through the windows, but I do spot some of these bisque dolls. Oh my gosh, they are just too sweet, and there are so many of them. And then I spot these cute little pixies, and they were 80 for the set, so for resale, can't really touch. And most of the bisque dolls were about retail as well. Granted, that seems to kind of be a common theme in this store, but if I'm ever in the area, I always do like to stop by because you never know what you might find. Here I see are these amazing cat pins. Oh my gosh, those are so extravagant. They have such a good array of just littles. They have great glassware. They have some vintage toys and a lot of, of course, bisque figures. My goodness, look at all of them. It's a small little village, as you can see. All right, and you can see we are coming into the vintage kitchen area. So we are coming across Pyrex, uh, vintage kitchen wall decor, Look at all of it. I loved this little tin litho tea set. Ooh, that um, bunny is really cute as well. A lot of very sweet stuff to look at. I thought she was really neat in the little shelf. And like I said, so many good pottery moments. Some fiesta wear from what it looked like. And here's an overview. Oh my gosh. And look at all of these syrup pitchers. I was so in awe. Somebody certainly had the collection. I loved this one. And oh my gosh, look at this mascot head. Oh, it was about 240. Such a cool find. Unfortunately, I don't want to be shipping that. And of course, records some old ephemera i did spot this vintage cookie jar book whenever i can find these old vintage uh price guides i do like to pick them up because they are really helpful to learn more about vintage and stuff you haven't seen before granted the prices will always be outdated but for knowledge and gathering um you know little tidbits in the back of your brain while you're out shopping they're helpful and next i do spot those ohio art tin litho drums granted again about retail can't really move and oh my gosh i love this swan uh, and her babies and the set was about 80 hello and when i said they had pottery i was not joking i mean there is such an array you know, pottery is something I'm still researching and trying to learn more and more about. Um, so I'm quite the newbie, so it's a little bit above my head. But um, it is a lot of fun to look at. And I don't know what was happening in this clip. <clears throat> um, <laughs> I just kept it in because it made me laugh. But I did find this sweet little doll um, set furniture. It was pretty cute. Again, about retail. Um, I did end up picking a few small little wicker baskets up though. And I don't know what was going on in this video, but I just do not know how to film, especially in this video. So I do apologize, wonky arm. I don't know what was going on, but.
but here's an overview of a pretty cool room. Um, I loved the sunflowers painted on the wall. They were really fun. And so now we're about to enter more of a mantique, quote unquote, uh, room. So a lot of tools, a lot of, um, you know, older um, cookware, some cast iron pans. So those are really fun to look at. Uh, there were quite the range of sizes. And those sharp things, I don't know what the name of those are. Those look terrifying, straight out of a horror movie. Honestly, a lot of these things on the wall do. But, um, I don't know. Maybe I should stop watching horror movies. Oh my gosh, I just wanted to show off this cute, uh, bedroom set. I loved the blue detailing on it. And I'm just gonna pan through do an overview. Oh my gosh, do you see these stairs? The stairs are worth coming to this place alone. You just feel very fancy walking up them. And I did spot these awesome metal kitschy wall hangings, but they did have a significant amount of damage. All right, and thank you guys so much for watching. Of course, I am Cole at Kitschy Flower. Go ahead, give me a follow. I am Kitschy Flower on all social media platforms, YouTube, TikTok, Instagram, whatnot. And I think that pretty much sums it up. Until next time, bye.